Hello everyone, my name is Maria Mokhtar. You know this man, Najib Abdul Razak, the Prime Minister of Malaysia, also goes by the alias MO1. The Chosen One, Mr. Flom, Boogies Pirate, Badut, or as Dr. Mahdi Muhammad calls him, Penyamun, Perompa, Penipu, dan Penyanga. Now here's some breaking news. After GE14, Najib will no longer be the Prime Minister of Malaysia. Did you think I made a mistake? I didn't. Najib will not be PM because after GE14, he will make himself the Malaysian President for life. I'm not joking and this is not fake news. Do you want to know what fake news is? Fake news happens every time Najib opens his mouth. Everything that he says is fake. Remember the 2.6 billion ringgit donation? He said it came from an Arab prince. That's a fake. There was no Arab prince because the money came from one MDB. Remember he said he did not know the Mongolian model Altantuya Sharibu? That is a fake. The late P.I. Bala said that both he and Abdul Razak Baginda knew her very well. Remember at G13, he said that all religions could be practiced in peace and harmony. Fake, fake and fake. Shia Muslims are persecuted, their places of worship raided and many are arrested. Non-Muslim places of worship, like temples, are demolished. Crosses on churches are removed, Bibles are seized. Remember A. Coogan, who died in the police lockup? The police said he died of sudden death. We know that's a fake. Coogan was tortured. That is the truth. The government wants to pass the anti-fake news bill to punish us. For example, when we write to say that a politician has stolen the rakyat's money or that the politician has lied, then we are the ones who get into trouble. By right, the politician should be investigated and punished. The anti-fake news bill is meant to scare you so that you do not share things like this video and the articles on my website with your friends. Fake news is actually government propaganda. They want you to believe that the statements that come out of Putrajaya are the only real news. You are not allowed to criticize them. So don't be scared by the anti-fake news bill. Oppose it. I said that Najib will make himself president for life after GE14. That is not fake. That is what he would like to be. But you can stop it. Go out and vote in GE14. Thank you for listening. Speak to you soon. Goodbye.